Vivi and Mewtwo? Yeah, Vivi actually is playing a lot of Mewtwo today. I know he played him in two of the games against me. He played it against one of the other people that I was watching him play against. Uh, he, when Even if you don't remember, the point is he's playing Mewtwo today. Exactly. A lot of Mewtwo. Maybe he want to add some to his repertoire. There's n literally nothing wrong with his Lucario. His Lucario is amazing, oh, but yeah. sometimes... It makes it's a, it's a, it makes your life a little easier to know somebody else. So Though I think it will be interesting that Sketch does have a Mewtwo that he's brought out a few times in brackets. Here, right. So he has Sketch the basic also. idea of what he's dealing with here, and then also that shield on occasion. But we'll see we'll see how this turns out for him. Right now, we'll be As getting now? Yep. a really good percent lead. All right, I respect that. <laughs> the platform <laughs> kind of brought him back into it. I, on one hand, I kind of wanted to see just like the complete explosion, but on the other hand, like. <laughs> gotta see what happens. Oh, I'm actually surprised that we're still seeing uh, we're seeing Sketch get away with a lot of these bombs. We've seen Mewtwo's in the past kind of like tossing shadow balls up on those platforms to like pressure the right. ability to do that. Uh, might just be the fact that Vivi's not used to having a projectile that's j just as fast as shadow balls where he can shoot that, or it might just be a difference in Correct. his play style. Oh, that upper lasts forever! <laughs> oh my goodness. It hurts. It, it hurts. does. Though. At this point, I do, I think Sketch will die maybe 20 more percent to up throw with this one trade. Wait, actually, no, not even 20. He'll probably die now to up He throw. might, because Mewtwo's up throw is a problem. <laughs> Oi! Especially now with this much weight, because I was thinking maybe 70, not, but 100, he should. He should be able to get it done. Yep, yeah. this is it. Yeah, there you go. That hurts. Up throw hurts. This entire character hurts. Yeah. <laughs> You're just getting beaten by a psychic humanoid, and it's just it's painful. Uh, though I imagine Wooly's uh, uh, bomb to fail will still work. Maybe up to up air, but I think Mewtwo might be out of the percent for that to last long enough. So. That's even if he gets to touch him. Yeah. BB oh, Dude, he's uh, dead. Yeah, he's gone. I, think, I don't think he touched him that second block. I don't think so either. I think it was out 100 from the time that he died once to the time that he died permanently. Why is Mewtwo's forward air so strong? But why does it also combo into itself? It combos into itself. It's strong. It comes out like what, frame five or six or something like that. I want to say it's five or six, yeah, something it's like Sheik's that. It's Sheikspear. It's Sheikspear, but it, like it's Sheikspear, but it kills. It doesn't, like. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. We shout out to Solid Tony for resubbing for two months. Thank you. We love you. That Whoa. Cool. <laughs> we love you so much. Very strong words. Hey, if you don't love your scene, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> right. Though, Sketch going to the triplats, especially Battlefield, and thinking maybe he can last a little bit longer against this onslaught of damage that BB's been throwing at him. Oh, maybe a little bit more boomerangs from Sketch. Just control the space somehow. Because that way, if he releases an uncharged Shadow Ball, your boomerang clanks so you don't get hit. You know, and then if you get it out, then you control the space. He has to respect it for that short amount of time that it's out. And I, Tuning gets a lot off of that boomerang, like whether it's like run up, up smash, this right. basic post set. He can get a lot off of that. But right now, he's not even able to get to the point where he's allowed to throw things. He's just playing on the back foot right now, trying to get those bombs out because he doesn't have the options. He's pressing him very hard. Nice up air. Ooh, catching up with the second one on the wall. Good following of the drift there. Is that Ooh, almost. If this wasn't Battlefield, back. Battlefield can't he had to catch the boomerang to mess up his frame trap. Ooh. Oh, up throw. That's, yeah. Yeah, this character's fast. Very fast after those buffs. But now it's serious. This is the exact same position that they were in game one, pretty much. Almost down to the percent. Right. And we saw how that ended up. So, Sketch. Sketch needs to figure control. out how to control space right now. He needs to control space. He's trying to break Mewtwo's zone. It's not going to work. Especially Create as a your zono. own zone. Yeah. As a zono that may not have the best approach options, trying to get in on a character. Nice. Let's very, good. very good confirm. Good bomb to up there. Yeah. Create good. your own zone. Set it. Because when you're trying to break his as a character like Tunic, it's not going to work. Very good call out. Nailed a fail. Yeah. Just getting that plus 10. I feel like we've been seeing VV hold a lot of stage control also. Yeah, he's which been holding the stage the whole time. Yeah, which this whole set. is difficult. As Sketch has nowhere to run away if he wants to get a bomb. He has nowhere to go to get that boomerang to come out. He's right. just having to play up in Mewtwo's face as a projectile kill. Okay, okay. <laughs> Good spot dodge there. I don't think he will die just yet. No, he's not dying to up throw yet. He's getting there. Yeah. Maybe. Without any rage, it might need to be like 120. 
Yeah, it might be. That actually scales a lot with rage, which I just didn't know up until more recently. Oh, oh but Sketch has brought this back in a matter of 10 seconds. Though now, at 70, he's probably... It's starting to get a little scary, now. yep. And I... Ooh, devil's on flashes. He should have done the bomb a little earlier. Would have clipped him through the platform because he's raising his hand through it. I think he was worried about... Oh, oh the, the bomb boss. saved his life! Oh, my God! Projectiles are the best friend a little boy can have by the looks oh, of it. Oh. Ooh, I think he was expecting a little bit different. The eye was trying oh to get that. My. The forward air is going to kill you from across the stage. Yeah. Barely, <laughs> but it's going to do it, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Really close though from Sketch, bringing he, it back. Really I feel really like he figured out what to do way too late. It yeah. was just too late. You realize it's like that last 30 ish seconds, but at that point, he was about to get killed. Yeah, and he played from behind the whole set. The bombs coming in clutch in general there. Like we saw, actually, that one actually came in clutch for Vivi yeah. on that replay. But just in general, the bombs having a really big effect on that because that just always, always had at least one out, often two. Right. Other than that, it, it would have been... I wish I wish Sketch would have adapted a bit earlier. I would like to have seen... Because he started to figure out, and then I wanted to see what Vivi would have done if he would have stood Mewtwo or if he would have switched off to Lucario. Because I like his Lucario. I am 